Hello guys, I'm BRT Cobra and welcome back to Green Hell. Um, yeah, I've learned how to survive basically and now I'm just going to share a day with you. Uh, my protein, my carbs, my water, my fats are reasonable. Uh, I do need more water, I do need more carbs. Fats, easy, coconuts, carbs, coconuts, all, all the little vegetables that you find that look like mini tomatoes. Um, I think first, what I'm going to do, just snap to uh, my axe, which I don't have, so we're going to have to create one. Uh, we're going to put a coconut in the belly. So let's craft that. That's the wrong thing. I have no idea why I just did that. Okay, we have a slot one available, so start over. Craft. I always drop a stick. Why do I drop a stick? Oh, I have no rock. Okay, do you know what? Let's just go look for some uh, rocks here. Uh, should be easy enough to find. What's this? A can? Ooh. Do you know what I think that might be? I think that might be uh, some protein right there. Let's smash this coconut with a spear, if possible. It is. That is fats taken care of. There's my axe. It's on the floor. What's it doing on the floor? Okay, so we're going to drop coconut. And hopefully... Going to hit it? I failed. Do you know what? Forget the coconut. Look how beautiful the game looks. I did have a rusty machete. I threw it at a bird that was stationary somewhere and uh, it just disappeared. Just vamoose. Gone. So I basically threw it away. Oh, okay, here's some protein. We don't even need to worry about that. We have protein. Let's just check if we have um, some dry stuff to burn. We don't. Best thing to do is just chop down a palm leaf. There is a herb there on the floor. Let's take a dry palm leaf. There has to be, oh yeah, there's one. I think my main boggle on this game at the moment is trying, where's that plant? It's trying to keep a, a reasonable fire uh, going. I find it very difficult because it's always raining. And what is happening here? It's going really weird. Am I not even breaking that? So I don't know what is going on. All right, stamina, good. Okay, we are definitely hitting this plant now. It's not a tobacco plant, is it? It's unknown herb. Look what we found. Oh my god, my trap has caught uh, a tapir. I think that is. Now, this is really good because we can get these bone needles from the bones if I so want to, to remove worms and stuff. I'm going to harvest my um, whatever that is. My parrot. I'm going to reset the trap. And we're going to go and make a fire. Fill up on protein. I think we need to go. What's in my way? All these palm leaves, isn't it? So yeah, I'm going to go back here. I'm going to try and light a fire successfully. Uh, generally, it lights just fine. The problem I have is the rain. Constantly putting my damn fire out. We have meat on the fire even, so yeah. My fire lighting skills are so damn high now. There you go. Put that ember in. Just let those cook. Every time it rains, uh, the cooking process on the meats in this game go back to zero. I wish the developers would update it so we can continue cooking. You know, when you put a chicken in the oven and you cook it for an hour, but then you turn the oven off, it doesn't go back to raw. Why does it do it in this game? I don't know. Anyway, uh, the objective here today is to get stats back. Let's just move some things so we don't accidentally eat raw meat. Because if you eat raw meat, you get worms. And that is not good because I have not found a plant to cure worms yet. So I don't want them. It doesn't hurt you as such. It just puts it... So like whenever you... Uh, your, your hunger and everything basically goes down faster. We, we don't want that. What's this? Hang on. 
Protein, fats, carbs. I found this on the floor. Do you know what? I'm just going to eat it. There we go. But uh, anybody wondering, I don't know what day I'm on, to be honest. I think it's like day 12, something like that. Maybe more. Look at all this. Coconuts junk is everywhere. There's my pan. It's not even in the fire anymore. It's crazy. Let's put it in the, not fire, the in the water collects thing. Let's put it actually in. There you go. Now it will collect more. Uh, one downside to this game I've noticed is the clutter. Every time you empty your backpack, uh, shit goes everywhere. As you can see, you've got coconuts all over the place. And the problem is, it doesn't go away. Like, you don't need storage in this game, because even if you save, the junk stays on the floor. Constantly. And you end up with the game starting to lag because you've left everything on the floor. Uh, devs, please, debris, let it despawn. Please. It's so annoying. Look, is that... <coughs> Look, it's everywhere, like coconuts everywhere, shells everywhere. Oh, it's so frustrating. It, it, it's, it's so annoying. My meat's nearly cooked. My, my cooking skills are going up, yes. The more you cook, uh, the quicker, you know, the more your skills go up, the quicker all this goes up and the quicker things get done. So you don't have to worry about the rain so much. I should build a shelter, really, to shelter the fire, but it doesn't tend to work for me. It still goes out. Uh, this here is a cooking rack, but I can't put a fire underneath it. If I do, uh, there's a bug and I can't craft the fire underneath, so that's shit. This is so annoying. Bones and stuff everywhere. Look, let's, uh, let me show you something. I'm gonna pick up one bone. I'm gonna make a needle to remove worms. Just harvest a bone and then you get needles. I think two. Uh, we've got unknown herbs here, which you mix with bandages, obviously. I've got two tobacco dressings here. Bandage plus tobacco plant. That, uh, heals snake wounds. I have an ash dressing. I believe this is for mosquito bites or ant bites and so on it works well and i'm happy with that uh, i do need to make an arrow let's go with a small stick is it i'm not sure i believe so so there we have an arrow i'm not sure if it if there's room for it there is good so we're going to make one more because i mean the arrows don't kill the tapir and stuff in one hit so they're kind of useless for that but they are good for I don't know. Killing small stuff. Let's see. Get one more and create some space. There we go. It's good, isn't it? So, let's take a look at our stats now. Very, very high. So, if we eat um, one of these. Let me just check the flat. Fat 16. Okay. So, it's carbs. We have a problem with carbs. That's the main thing now. But to be honest, carbs are okay. Uh, there are little plants around that have like, what look like tomatoes on them. And you can eat those fruits and it's enough. There's some eggs. Ooh, I've never found eggs before. These, you can see them there. Take these and your carbs will go up. Let's just separate some stuff so we don't accidentally eat other things. So carbs up six, carbs up six, and six again. Uh, I'm not sure about these mushrooms. They glow green in the dark. Uh, should we try and eat this egg? Disgusting. Ugh. Okay, ten proteins, ten fats. It's disgusting, but it didn't actually do Ugh. anything bad. Uh, these give you five carbs. No poisoning, so we're going to eat these. I'm loving this. Okay, now let's look. There we go. Stats fully maxed out. And that is all you have to do every single day you play in this game. To put your stats up. Easy. Really. And what was that? A blade? I must have dropped that. Let me just see. Oh yeah, because I have all this stuff. But yep. Yeah. The objective of the game, keep the four vitals up. And you can't fail. Protein, fats, water, 
cops. And then it becomes a, a situation where it's like, well, what do we do now? <laughs> because, oh, it fires an arrow every time I save there. That's annoying. Remind me to put that away before I save. But yeah, I mean, surviving the game is easy. Sanity, oh my God, that is so easy to deal with. I used to struggle with it. Everybody struggled with it, but it's it's too easy to deal with. Just make sure you find honey um, from a bee's nest. Plenty of stuff, light fire, sleep, all that kind of stuff will fix that. And just keep checking your body. Every time a magnifying glass icon appears, just check your body for... Oh, whoops. Check your body for leeches and, and stuff like that, because this way you won't get uh, bad sanity. My health, look at it. Completely maxed out. My uh, stamina and rest, everything is, is good. Pretty much left with nothing to do for the entire day. Because I won't eat and stuff again until the next day. Let's get this tobacco plant. I mean, it may be a good idea just to stock up and stuff now. I didn't really need that tobacco plant. I've got these herbs. If we just move them over, maybe we can pick that up. There you go. And you craft that with a bandage. But I already have dressings for that. I don't know what this is. Campfire ash. Oh yeah, mix that with a dressing too to make an ash, ash dressing. Charcoal, not, I don't know what that's for yet. But yeah, everything I need is there. Fire's good. Food, exquisite. Painkillers even. Maggots. In case you get a, a bad injury and you don't dress it in time. Skin starts to rot. Put maggots on it. Cleans the wound. This way you can then take medication for your fever that you may have occurred and uh, dress it up with a bandage. So yeah, keep maggots. Always keep maggots. But yeah, it's... Uh, don't really have a lot to do now. I could go looking for fruit, but there's coconuts all over the place, look. So what do you do? My health just went down a bit, but no, bo no bother. I mean, look at all these coconuts. They're everywhere. It gives me water. And if you can't find water, just drop a coconut shell on the ground. When it rains, they will fill. And it's an easy day in the rainforest. I'm going to pick all these up just because. There's a half-eaten one there. There's one actually cracked open. I wonder if it's safe to eat. Let's, uh, come on. Let's see. Yeah, it's good. It's actually good. So sometimes they fall and they uh, crack open. What's this? A stone. I need that. Coconuts everywhere. Nice graphics. Look at this. Here's a carcass. This is where you get your maggots. And of course, the occasional bone as well. There's one right there. But uh, I don't need it. I don't want it. There's a... See this? Watch this. Ow, 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 ow. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's a rash. Now you can leave it. Sleep it off. It's all good. Or... You can get the ash bandage. Uh, let me just check, see. You can get your ash bandage and uh, fix it that way. So I don't know where I got the rash. I would think it'd be this foot. Yeah. So grab that. Oh, it's not ash bandage. Which one is it? Oh, my God. Oh, I can't remember which one it is. All right, we don't have uh, the bandage for that. It's the lily one, isn't it? I don't have that. Okay, so you mix uh, with that unknown herb, you mix that up with a bandage and it becomes a lily bandage and you put it on the rash, but the rash is nothing. The more uh, carbs here. The rash will just sleep off. We could look for a yellow plant, hopefully, and I can show you. But the rash will probably be gone by the time... Uh, I can show you. Let's try and find a yellow bandage. A yellow plant, sorry. Well, we have a leech. No idea where. Rash is still there. Leech is probably sucking the bejesus out of it. There he is. Get off me. Some cool sounds in this game. Let me go back to base. It's funny, I just noticed the rash does give you minus one sanity, but yeah, it's nothing. 
It just, like I said, it disappears. There's another dead parrot. Can't even take it. But yeah, if you do get a rash, use the uh, lily. Lily dressing, which is the unknown herb that I just picked up. This one look, looks like this. And uh, mix it with a bandage. I don't know if I can actually do that now. I can't, can I? Can't like switch bandages. But yeah, the rash will be gone in a minute. So yeah, the rash uh, already has gone. So that doesn't even last long. And all we have to do is sleep. To get rid of the sanity that we lost. Or build a campfire. Yeah, let's just have a quick rest. We lost uh, minus one sanity. We just gained plus three sanity. Easy peasy. All right, now we actually need to go to bed and sleep for the night. Anyway, guys, there it is. Just surviving one day. Uh, dead easy. Look at all my stats. Just high all the time. Uh, food. So easy. I mean, look at it. It's everywhere. Yeah, green forest. Not as hard as I thought. It's actually quite easy. But I hope you enjoyed this one day play. Uh, we're going to be on like day 12 or something. Maybe more uh, after I sleep. But yeah, till the next one. See you. Bye-bye.